Hello everybody. Now in the last video I showed you how to hook up your front loader NES using AV cables. Now I'm going to tell you how I got this system. This is my story. I got this almost 20 years ago. And uh, at the time it still worked but only for a short period of time and then it stopped working. I was lucky enough to keep this because years later I disabled the lockout chip and it was able to play games again and I think I disabled it around 2008 or 2009 I don't remember and I was able to play games again and that was awesome eventually I had to replace the 72 pin connector but I didn't have to do it until a couple years later and it still works and it still works hopefully this system will last forever hopefully and uh, I won't have to do any more maintenance except probably replace another 72 pin connector but probably not until the near future so now this this system does need uh, refurbishing but only minor all I really need is and I'm gonna show you first off I need the uh, screws to uh, this and this because uh, I don't have the screws to these I need to replace this and I need the bar for uh, this as well because there was originally a metal bar and I must have ta taken it out a long time ago and I shouldn't have but oh well but that's basically it all it really needs is a little refurbishing and that's pretty much it. Hopefully I'll make it like new again when I can refurbish it. So that's all I really got to say about that. That is my story and how I got it. And uh, I hope you enjoyed it. So peace out to you all. Blog you later.